Welcome to University of Chimera Stadium in steamy Tombstone, Arizona, where the only thing hotter than the heat is the ceaseless sinning. The players are ready to rock the red zone and red light district tonight. Let's go down to the field for kickoff. Yeah, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The San Francisco 49ers take on the Cardinal Sins. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. Hey, man, these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down in a very lot. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Second down in a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Yo, seriously, man. He think you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. Taylor, I'm still on Silla. I am on Hill and I'm still on Second down and more than the QB would like. That's a big gain run on that. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. Third down and nine. And that's how you run the football. First down. Yeah. 
And it's first and ten. And he pumped up. It's just like the Fourth of July, only with blood and guts. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. First down! And it's first and ten. The defense better look. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down in a very lot. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Second down and long. Picks up 10 on that run. Man, he nearly broke that one open, Bricks. Yeah, and I nearly married Trim Big Assian. And I nearly did not crap my pants earlier. Nearly as overrated, Grim. And that'll bring up third and one. <laughs> and he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not gonna dance now. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Send a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. First and two. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's 
It's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. Oh, that was a great throw and a great catch. Yeah, but, but it was in there. Man, what a hit that was. Hey, man, nobody can touch me with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? And it's first and ten. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. Second down and inches. Oh, man, the offense caught him. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it from too fast. <laughs> And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. Eight. And he picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him ten yards. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Second down, the second, and the defense goes for the jug, and the whistle blows the play dead, along with the quarterback. Second down, an inch. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down in a lot. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And it plays a defense. Schmuck. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a nice cap. Boom! <laughs> and it's first and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time.
And it's first and ten. And that's a nice run for a first down. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Well, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And it's first and ten. Not much there, maybe a yard. Second down and nine. Defensive players go berserk. They've been known to rip the heads off of enemy. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. And coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh his head just exploded. What a miss, what a miss. He's a shit. And it's first and ten. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on. Oh, man, he really wants it. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Yeah. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. First in and three. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, with the brutal hit. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Knock the wind out of that quarterback. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. That pass was way off target, but I'm pretty sure the QB will blame the receiver as he always does. Third down and, well, good luck. And he was stuck to him like glue. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a palm grim. That cross-pitching, unbelievable. And that'll be a touchback. I don't feel comfortable giving him a size while we're broadcasting, Grim. And it's first and ten. <laughs> he is running like an old guy looking... Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! I don't know which one you The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright 
suicide grin. They save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, I don't think the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. Second down and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. run there for eight yards. Second down and two. of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest tits? Where? First down and nine. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. First and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have... He just got run over by a freight train. Now it's just a race for the loose ball. And it's first and ten. Call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the other. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Well, this guy told him today, Bricks, he had to step up his game. Not only did he step up there, he blew up. <laughs> nice extra effort. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. The Cardinal sins get crushed and lose by forfeit. Someone get more body bags. And let's go down to the field and hear the MVP. He's a real role model for the kids, Bricks. That is, if you want your kids to be a roid raging narcissist with uncontrollable verbal diarrhea. Oh, that personality disorder has a name. It's called autotrophism. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...